Thanks, Alan. Well, in a horrific accident outside an Orcutt Elementary School today, police say a grandmother lost control of her car and mowed down four children. It happened just before noon at Alice Shaw Elementary School off South Bradley Road. News Channel 3's Natalie Tavidian joins us live from the scene tonight. Natalie, this was just a terrifying accident. Beth and CJ, it was, and you can really see it in the faces of a lot of the parents that were here. So this is where the car ended up. The California Highway Patrol says that before the car got here, it went over this curb right here. So this is how close the parking lot is to the school campus. It ended up right behind me. You can still still see the skid marks out there behind me. Now, a lot of parents over here were, uh, some parents were crying. Others said that they were afraid. The child, all four of them were second graders, the three of the injured injuries were minor. The fourth child was trans uh, was airlifted to Santa Barbara. I couldn't believe it. I didn't know what was happening in the midst of the chaos. It happened in the middle of the day. A chopper, ambulances, and the California Highway Patrol. Officers say a grandmother was making her way to the Alice Shaw School in Orchid to pick up her grandchild when she mistakenly pushed the gas pedal instead of the brakes. There was a uh, a couple of students that were standing near to the flagpole, which uh, she ran over. It was four students, all second graders. Three of them had minor injuries. The fourth child was pinned under the car. Paramedics treated the child, who then was airlifted by a CalStar helicopter to Santa Barbara Cottage Hospital. The school went on lockdown during the chaos. The school was put on lockdown to try to control the situation and to, to control traffic so that we could make sure all of our students were safe. Parents were in tears, saying this could have been anyone's child. Emotionally, it's, it's heartbreaking right now. Officers say the child could have suffered internal injuries while trapped under this car. I'm probably more concerned about the parent that just has had had that accident happen right now. That's my, that's who I'm concerned about the most right now. So school was released at its usual time. Every parent in the district did get a message about what happened here in Orchids today. Some parents did show up to just make sure that their, their kids were okay. Now the CHP again saying that this looked like an accident, but it does remain under investigation. Reporting live in Orchid, Natalie Tavidian, News Channel 3. Okay.